Maybe you have school, taking care of the kids, possibly work. Maybe like our friend Rick here, he's just a little lazy. Well, on today's Body Shaping Show, we're going to help you get a total body workout in half the time. So you want to stay tuned. Are you crazy? <laughs> what? Come on, wait. Off. No, 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 no. We're getting a total body workout. You'll get the workout done, and then we'll go through. I'm trying to tip him over, but you know it's a little difficult. See, bigger is better. Oh. Don't go anywhere. Jen will be back. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> All right, folks, we're here at the Super Club Breezes in the Nassau, Bahamas. And it's all about getting in the gym and getting out of there real quick. Start with the warm-up right here. You got some basic taps working for the lower body. Getting that blood pumping. How you doing, Paige? I'm doing great. Oh, you really? So Jen and Rick are having fun already. We're going to get here and do some uh, jet skiing. It's always about think? having a good time. So you're going to get the workout done quick so you can go out and play, all right? Here we go. Four, three, march it out right here. Easy march. And once again, we're just going to start with your warm up. You got marchers here taking four taps, all right? On four. Four, three, this leg taps right here. Just tap. Give me four more. Four more. Four, three, march it out. Right here, march it. Woo! I, I'm a little tired from trying to push Rick. I'm sorry, I'm a little quiet. Hold the pattern with that hammock thing, all right? <laughs> you think you can overpower Rick? That's about Never something else, guys. Here we go. We got four more taps here. Four, three, Two, put the four taps right here. Three. March it out four times. You got it there. One more time. Four taps here. March it out. Four, three. Now walk up four times. Easy walks. Come up. You want to start getting your body moving because next time we're doing lower body work. So you just want to get some blood getting there. Warm it up a little bit. Two more. Remember, total body workout. Half the time. time. Here we go, guys. Right here. Tap four times. Right here. Four, three. Two, march it up. Hi, every little bit helps. You gotta get up and move. It's better than just sitting there for 15 minutes. Get up and do something. Anything, all right? Here we go. Four, three, walk forward. Let's go up. Oh. One more time. Last time, guys. Stay right here. March it out. I want you to take this leg right here, your left leg, and bring it forward with your heel down. It's gonna come right here. Lower your body down. Keep your abs in, your chest lifted. There you go. Hand above your kneecap and lower down. Just keep your chin up and hold the stretch. Try not to bounce. You don't want to bounce and tear anything in here. Just hold it steady. Good. Now take that same leg and extend it back. This knee stays aligned right over your heel. Lower down. Chest up nice and tall. And hold it right here. You know what? You get a very nice stretch in the hip flexor. Right up here within the hip on the back leg. If you tuck under a little bit. There you go. Now lift up. Right here. Here we go. In. Stretch into your calf muscle. Right here. In. Out. Give me four more. Four. four. Two more. Two. Last one, guys. Good. Now bring this leg in. Guess what? This hill, your right goes down. Same thing. Weight shifts over. Oh, we need to reach it up. Look forward. There you go. Don't bounce your stretch. Hold it right here. You know, you don't have to spend three hours a day in the gym. You can really get a fabulous workout in a short amount of time. And you know something? Doing a little bit is better than doing nothing. That's what Paige told you at the top of the show. You'll have more energy for all your recreational activities later on in the day. Woohoo! Now, say Thank that God I can. Extend this leg back, please. Come down right here. I like holding our stretch to the furry. I know, it out. we got some stretch. All right, we're going to come back to a calf stretch. Then you got to grab your step. This is the lower body work. Mary Jean's going to join us also, so let's get ready, guys. Come right up here, lift up. Right here, calf stretch, in and out. All right, folks, it's all about getting in there quick and getting out. We're starting with the lower body. Mary Jean has joined us. As you can see right now, we're doing alternating lunges here as far as stepping off the step, just alternating between coming back and forth on our step. Mary Jean's keeping her foot right there, stationary on her step. Still getting the benefits of this movement. If you have some knee problems or you're afraid you may not be able to make that alignment right there, because your knee's got to line up right over your heel. Down, up. That's right, Kendall. And I feel much safer this way. And that's fine, because you're still getting the benefits of the exercise, all right? So make sure your chest is lifted, your abdominals are tight, and push off. Sit down, push off. Got weights added here for a little added intensity. If you don't have them, that's okay. If it's too much for you right away, get rid of the weight. <laughs> How you doing, Jen? I'm doing great. You know, you both brought up so many wonderful points. I was kind of listening to you. 
But for those of you who have never done this before, you can have problems being a bit wobbly. Maybe you want to use a chair to help with your balance, or you can even put a body bar in Ooh. front of you. And what we're doing right now is a little bit more advanced because we're fatiguing one leg and, and then moving on to the next. And fatigue, so hurry up with that story because we got to go on to the next oh, leg here. Oh, my God. Come back here, guys, right here. I want you to switch legs. Don't forget, once that leg gets fatigued, you ready? ready. Start your other leg. Let's go. Down. Push off. <laughs> Don't forget, you got that option like Mary G. You can stay there on your step and just go down and up. We can do that same push off. It's your call, all right? Let's go. Now we're working the glutes, the quads of the front leg. And you notice we're working the quads of the back leg. With the step, a little bit more intensity, a little bit more work for your glutes. And don't forget. Really the cardiovascular off, Ken. Oh, oh no. yeah, don't forget. Don't think your heart's not pumping out just Ooh. doing this. Certainly. Four more. Four. Oh. Three. Ten. Last two. Two. One more. I don't want you to end up on top of your step. Just step up on your step. Step up to one side. We're going to take single squats coming off the side. Make sure you watch your alignment. Keep your chest up. Abdominals nice and tight. Okay, ready? Four, three, two. Here we go. Right here. Just down. Down. And we've told you a hundred times or so on this show. Make sure you just keep your form, guys. You're sitting in a chair. Sit down. Stand up. Sit down. That's all it is. No big major science or nothing. You're just going to sit down and get a good workout. Sit down and work your lower body. Eight. Feel it this hip right here. Ooh. Oh, ah, yeah. burn. Give me four more. Four. four. Come on, Mary Jean, let's help now. Three. Three. Two more. <laughs> Two. Two. Last one. And now, one. Stay up here for a second because it's not over yet. I want you to try to really okay. get the intensity going. You're going to take three squats and come up on the fourth one, okay? Ready? Three off the side. Here we go, right here. One, two, three. Do it again. These are controlled ah, pulses. Ah, ah, there you go. Sit into it. That's why I like a big bounce enough to get your alignment. Right there. Right there. Up. It's good down. to do them in this light too, Kendall. The weights get too much, you can yeah. always bring them here and rest them on your quads. Or lose the weights all together. It's your call. Two more. Just do the work. Ah, last one. There you go. Now stay up here, because you know what? You gotta do the single squats on this side. Right, so shift your body them. over. Ready on four guys? Mm -hmm. Four, three, two, this side. Let's go. Singles. Down. Now don't forget, if it gets too much of a step, lose your step. Just come right here. Step out to the side. Same thing. Still getting the benefits of your exercise right there. But you still maintain the same form and everything, all right? Chest up. Abdominals tight. Back up nice and tall. Four more. Three. Three. Count with us at home. Two. Two. Last Woo. one, guys. Stay up here for me. Give you a little break because you know what's coming. Uh. Three off the side. Come back up on one. Ready, guys? Uh. Oh, yeah. All okay. right, ready? Three of them. Let's go. Right here. Let's go. One, two, three, go. This show's really about no excuses, which means you don't need the steps, you don't need the weight, you just need your body. Like Kendall said, you can be doing it with us right now. Am I guilting you into this at home? Mm-hmm, sounds like it. <laughs> two more of this, two more. Don't forget, it's about getting in the gym real quick and getting out. Doing squats is such a great Ooh. overall body movement. This is our last one. Stay up here and come back off your step. How can you one that... This is going to be those squats, okay? You know we do these 100 times with Smith machines or dumbbells with barbells. Here we go. Just simple dumbbells. Rest in here on your side or down here. Ready? Same thing as on the step. Let's squat. Down. There you go. And now, if you really want to save some time because you're talking about saving time in this workout, get a little upper body with it if you want. Here we go. Oh. There you go. Your call. Up. A little foreshadowing of what's to come later on in the program. Mm -hmm. Get them all ready. Little get tip here. All right. Sitting back and sitting into your heels. That's the secret. If you want to look at this from the side, you shouldn't stick out too far. You're right here. Sit down. Watch my knee alignment. Still over my heels. Sit down. Mm -hmm. Sit Looking down. good, Matt Brand Candle. There you go. All right, guys. Use those mirrors in the gym. That's what they're there for. Not just to check out your great outfit, but also to make sure you maintain in proper form. A lot of good form goes a long way, all right? Aww. Four more. Four. Three. Rick's standing off. He loves two. that. He's going to write that one. down as a quote. Good. Come in, guys. <laughs> now, once again, coming from the beginning, all 20 lunges. You got the option to keep your foot on your step like Mary Jean did or come with us. Ready? Let's lunge right here. Stay on the side. Stay here. Okay. Just stay right there. All the way. Plant it. Push off. Plant. Push off. Nice piece of grass right there. It's like a smashing that. Ah. This is a great endurance ah. builder. Four oh. more. Come on, MJ. Huh? I need you to motivate me. Two more. All right, Kendall. Let's go. Last one. There Five you go. More, oh, no. Switch sides. Ready? <laughs> Opposite side, guys. Ready? Set. Let's go at home. Come on.
Mary Jean, share them on at home, too. That's yeah, a scandal. Come on, you do. Get up off your butt and do the exercise. Oh, she's getting forceful there with you. you. Go. you yeah, Drill Sergeant MJ. <laughs> Here we go. Four more. Four. Three. Last two. Two. One more. Stay right here. Get those knees nice and tight right here. Ooh. Little squats right here. Just sit back, right? Let's go. Oh, let's go find Rick and Pace. They're coming back. They got upper body work. I'm going to show you how to get in there and get out of the gym real quick. You got your lower body done. They're going to show you how to do your upper body. Don't go anywhere. Oh, I go. Guess Paige got him off that hammock, huh? <laughs> We're moving on with like, getting in and getting out of the gym real fast. You ready, Paige? I'm ready. All right, we're going to give you two movements for chest, two movements for shoulders, and two movements for back. First movement, flat dumbbell bench press right here. Come up, squeeze right at the top, come down, get a nice stretch here. Beautiful, just like that. All right, now you would do three to four sets, 15 to 25 reps, depending on where you are in your cycle. And a lot of people twist at the top in their workout. A complete rotation at the top, just like that. Okay. Now, a lot of times people will do that on a fly movement. That's when you're coming, like hugging a big barrel. You know. You've yes. heard that before, haven't you? Well, you said that. Yes, last I time. did. Yes, you did. Okay, good. Nice okay, I have and three slow. more. All right, three, two, nice and controlled, nice and slow. And good job. All right. Now, the next movement for chest is going to be an incline dumbbell press. This is more for the upper chest. And most people are stronger in their chest workouts on the decline. And then the and next is flat bench, and then this is the, the weakest part of the chest. Is that correct? For most people. Actually, most nothing people. is written in stone, but usually people are stronger on a decline than an incline. And whenever you come down... You need to have your arms perpendicular to the floor. Three more. And bring your chest out when you push up. One more. Okay. All right. There you go. Good job. Okay, we're moving now to shoulders. Let me get this bench flat for you. All right, two movements for shoulders. My weights look so terribly small next to you. <laughs> But it works for me. It's not the amount, it's how you do it. First movement, side lateral raises. Come up, right about to there, parallel, down slow. We're working the side shoulder right here. Very good. Come on, up, down slow. Now you want to try not to lock your elbows on this one. You could straighten them out a little bit more. It's a little bit harder. Yes, Feel it? it is. All right, now if she needs a spot, I'm right here by the elbow. Yeah, two more. Four more. Four more. Four. He always. Yes. But that's good. Three. Two. Everyone in the gym needs someone to push nice up. Nice and slow on the way down. Get the negative. Good job, Paige. All right, now. Second movement here for the shoulders is going to be a press. Shoulder press. Straight up. Wow. Five. I got five more. Here we go. Five. Also, with this exercise, you need to bring down where your arms are perpendicular to the floor also. But if it's comfortable for you, because your range of motion may be different than Rick's or any other person. That's right, Paige. Everybody's flexibility is a little bit different. All right, we're going to move on over to back. First movement here for back is going to be pull-downs behind the neck. Okay. All right, you're up first. I'm going to move your hair so the viewers at home can see this lovely back you have here. <laughs> nice and I'm slow. working on it. There you go. It looks great. Thanks. Squeeze up slow. This is directed more towards the upper center back right here. You want to pull like there's two strings pulling the elbows down. Try not to focus on the biceps. Use your back. Good job. Thank you. Five more. Five. Nice and slow on the way up. Four. Beautiful. Even though Three. it's a get in and out of the, the gym fast, you still want to do your reps very slowly. That's right. One more. Up slow. Good form. Thank you. All right. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to change it around now. Because remember, we're trying to give you a couple of different exercises for each body part here. Now, she did it wide for the upper. I'm going to move more towards a little more of the center. I'm going to reverse grip up here and pull to the front, right to the chest. And that's a lot bigger range of motion. Up and, here. You want to try to keep the elbows close together. You'll feel it more in the back. And also it helps out, and I've said this before and I'll say it again, if you think of your hands as hooks, so you don't pull with your biceps, you want to use the muscle that you're working with it. Good point, Paige, you're right. Otherwise, people are going to lose more bicep than they are back. Mm -hmm. 
And Rick will put you through a great bicep workout also, so you don't have to worry about working that with the back. Maybe five more. Yeah. Five. Um, four. Three. My four. back isn't quite as developed as theirs, but I'm working on it. Don't leave us. Join the fun. More body shaping to follow. All right, now, Mary Jean and I are going to move on to arms. Now, when it comes to training arms, there's nothing better or quicker than supersetting. So that's what we're going to do. That's what I was saying to you before, Rick. My favorite workout. You out. like this? Mm -hmm. All right, seated dumbbell curls with the rope for the tricep extensions. Here we go. Come on. Nice and slow. Bring it up. Squeeze down slow. Biceps look great. Just like that. Nice form. Control. There you go, Mary Jean. That's it. Nice and controlled. Notice how she's getting the negative. She's coming down really slow. I like that. Like Come on. Up, squeeze, down, slow. Control I try to work movement. on the form a lot. Nice well, it shows. Keep going. All right, four more. Four more. Nice and slow. Four, down, slow. Good. Three, just like that. Two. All right, we're going to do one more. We're going to go right to the triceps now. We're trying to save time Ooh. in and out of the gym. All right, MJ, here we go. I'm going to get my form. All right. To me, that's very important. Okay. All right, just like that with the rope. We're going to concentrate on the back of the arm here, the tricep. Now, the elbow is just a hinge. It doesn't move. Beautiful. When you hold my elbows in place, you're forcing me to really do the exercise straight. You like that better? Okay. Yeah. Now, what the rope allows you to do is to turn the wrist at the bottom of the movement and really flex the tricep. Come on, MJ, let's go. Five. If she needs a spot, I'm right here. Four. Good. Three. Squeeze. Come on. Right. <laughs> Two. One more. Good. Right. When you notice it when I'm quiet, you know, I'm uh -huh. really concentrated. Now, you would do that probably three sets. Three sets of supersetting right there. All right. Now, I like to go together until I start to fatigue, and then I and do one at a time. Awesome. Well, I find when I superset, what I like to do when I superset, I go a little bit lighter on my weight because then I could really do the exercise in good form and really do it with strict. All right, now I'm going to go one at a time. One at a time. You do that. Down slow. You must get that naked. And I notice you're keeping your palm facing you as you go all the way down. The top. I like to come all the way up like this and turn it at the good, top. That's a good Just tip because like you're like turning your pinky in. So. That's right. Makes the bicep peak a little bit more. Two more each arm. That's right. Oh. All right, here we go. Last one. This is strong, man. I'm going to get you on that one. I'm going to get you on the next one. Okay. All right, now Let's we're going to go right over there. It's my turn to the tricep. Do uh, you need a spot, Rick? Um, but no, I am going to hold your elbows because I okay, want you good. to do this very strict also. All right, I like that. Now, right do there? I hold it right here? Right there. The elbow okay. is just a hinge. Squeeze the tricep. You can really see Rick's tricep working. This is so great. You really isolate this muscle. And I like to have great triceps. Five more. Here we go. Going. Five. Looking good, Rick. That's right. Four. Okay. You could do these. Two. All right. And one. Keep going. Okay. All right. Now to our next one. I'm going to go right here. Here's what I want you to do. I want you to grab the 10-pound dumbbell, stand up. Okay. And now we're going to do half reps. Elbows oh. like this. Like, oh, wow. Uh, right here. You're going to get me. I right got there. it. Come on. Come away. Down slow. Only halfway down. Back up. Ooh. Okay, now. Little modified version here. Try this. You'll feel this in your head right here, the lower head. Just like that. Right there. You get another yeah. part of the bicep muscle yes. you're working now. Different angles. That's what we're mm -hmm. trying to show you here. Just like that. Come on. Five. Four. Beautiful, Mary Jane. Three. Two more. Okay. Last one. Stay tuned. There's a relaxing cool down coming up next on Body Shaping. Okay, as you can see, I'm up. Yes, All right? I can You woke tell. me up, I'm up, and now it's payback time. You know why? You're going to do some hanging leg raises. Oh, I don't like oh, it. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. One, two, three. Oh. All right, now. Lower abdominals right here. This is perfect for it. You can keep the knees bent like this, or you can keep the legs straight and come up like this. That's a little bit more advanced. You feel it? Yeah, I feel that. You know what? I have to really support my lower back, so I'm going Take to go your with time. the knees up. Individual thing here. Take your time. Come up slow, down slow. Now, to get the sides, all you have to do is come to the side. Very simple. Okay, one to the side, yep. one to the side. I've got one for you. Oh. 
Oh, I see. Your creature, Oma. Uh-huh. All right. All right, now this is more for the upper. More for the upper abs a bit. See, you want to learn how to use the equipment that you have in the gym. You think of the machines where you curl forward. Same premise. Got the constant resistance because you're using the cable. And remember, think of yourself as a hinge. You should just be moving the upper body. Keep the stationary. Don't use your arms. Uh-huh. That's a good see? point, Jen. You see a lot of people doing this. They sit Sitting back. back. You don't want to do that. You want to curl down. Can you do the sit back one more time? I was in your way. You sit. People, you see people in the gym with too much weight and they're doing this. All they're doing is moving the hips. Keep the hips straight. Curl. As Rick always says, mind into the muscle. That's right, Jennifer. Now, if you want to get the sides, come across. Across. Very simple. Very basic. Very effective. Very, very, very. And you want to make sure... When you are working on your abdominal muscles, truly really change up your routine. Otherwise, you'll get bored. When we always say, last but not least, right. last fact, to go. The problem is this. This is usually the first place you gain weight yeah. and the last place that goes. Very true. All right, now I'm going to get up here and do some like this. Okay. Right? For someone who didn't want to work out at the start of the day because he thought he had so much to do, just like sit back on that habit, look how fast he got this workout in. You can do the same exact thing out at home. Total body workout. A little bit goes a long way, huh, Rick? Well, Jen, it's like this. When you start to train, you get energized. Mm -hmm. And you just keep going. All right. I'm going to do three more. Okay. <sighs> three don't go in. anywhere. <laughs> don't go anywhere. No, they can go. We can go. No, you you can go. go oh, no. Are you talking to me? Well, I'll see you next time on Body Shaping. Come on. Right there. Nice and slow. Beautiful.